Good morning all. Uh, today, electric vehicle charging. And I'm at Asda in South Ryslip. And there are loads of electric charging points here. Um, there are pod points. There are 10 in a row here. Now, these are double charging pod points. So there are actually 20 electric vehicle charging bays. The problem is, do not use. Out of order. Out of order. Out of order. Out of order. Every single one of these pod point chargers is do not use. Out of order. Now this isn't the full extent of the pod point chargers at this Asda in South Ryslip. There are eight more charging bays here, four posts. All of these are do not use out of order. These ones, the stickers are not on there, but there's yellow and black tape over the actual charging port. Here there are four of these round uh, pod point chargers, all of which are out of order. There's a pod point here, it's out of order. There are some more pod points over here, out of order, out of order, pod point here, out of order, and there's another one over there. And of course all these bays are iced. They've all got internal combustion engine vehicles in them because there's no charging here. There are six more electric vehicle charging bays here six uh, pod point charging points all of which are not lit up and I can only assume they're out of order. There are five more charging bays over here by the entrance and this one actually has a red light on it so it's got power to it but what does a red light mean? Yeah out of order. So what's going on here at uh, Asda in South Ryslip? Let's take a look at the PodPoint app. Right, well this is the PodPoint app and I'm here um, near the blue dot, near the RAF uh, North Holt there. And interestingly, PodPoint doesn't actually show them having any chargers here at Asda in South Ryslip. There's one across here to the right, which is um, at Lidl, I think it is, and I will go there after here. But uh, yeah, nothing showing on the PodPoint app. So even if you could connect to the charger, you wouldn't be able to confirm the charge. So uh, you wouldn't be able to get more than 15 minutes. But from what I can see, an electric vehicle owners are pretty canny. There's no electricity here. Otherwise, there would be cars here plugged in. Well, no matter, because now I'm crossing the road, looking left and right, um, because here there's an Aldi which is up there and they also have quite a large number of electric vehicle charging points. Let's check them out. Right here I am at Aldi and here there is a whole row of these Rolex charging points but as you can see this one's got a cover over it. Now it does say here um, free to use EV charging point and uh, a friend of mine lives around here so I have used these before and yes they were free to use not anymore because they're unusable now there are lots of these chargers here and they're double-sided so for every post there are two charging points I'm gonna have to walk on this mud now um, yes they're all covered up so that's two three four five and of course all these bays are now iced they've all got um, just regular cars parked in them and there's nothing wrong with that um, because the electric car chargers aren't working. Yes, there are 20 charging points here in total. And now, because these are all covered up, and I suppose the issue here is that these were free vend charging points. Well, it's now just not economic for a supermarket to give away free electricity because of the price of electricity. And I don't know whether these charge points can be upgraded to actually charge money. They probably can't. So, yeah, they're all hooded. 20 EV charging points, none in use. Now, I've just phoned um, PodPoint about these, I don't know, between 30 or 40 PodPoint 
charging bays um, at Asda South Ryslip. And they said something interesting. They said they're all out of warranty. And she also said they're an older model. But I'm not sure that these are an older model. They don't look any older than, than the ones at um, Wickham Retail Park, which are all still working. And then she just said, oh, we're in talks with Asda to try and work out what we're doing moving forward. Now, when I was filming the uh, Chargers at Aldi, a chap came up to me and he said, oh, I've complained about these. I've written to my MP. He said he'd written to Boris Johnson. Actually, of course, that would have been his MP, wouldn't it? Because uh, he's Uxbridge and South Ryslip, I believe. And I thought, well, that won't do any good. You're not going to get anything from that. And he said, no, nobody answered. Nobody's interested. Right, I've now come down to Lidl, in, also in South Ryslip, but it's a about a mile further south down Victoria Road and there is a pod point here now it's only a single pod point uh, this chap's just come out he's got a Kia Nero and now we've got this chap who's got an ID3 I think it is and he's uh, just going into the pod point so I suppose I'm next in the queue there is a Tesla here but he appears to be on the type 2 Oh, now would that be 7 kilowatt, or can Tesla do more than 7 kilowatt? Nevertheless, that's a separate charger, and the uh, the Rapid, only one car can take charge on the Rapid at any one time. You can either use the Chadamo, or you can use the CCS, but only one person can charge at any one time. So this pod point is actually working, and it must get a lot of use, I'd imagine, because these single rapid chargers are few and far between even around here in West London and so the situation here is quite different this charger works but of course there's a queue because it's so much in demand it being a rapid charger I mean it's actually not uh, that rapid I think these are maximum 50 kilowatt well the uh, ID3 uh, wasn't there for long I just had a quick look in the shop see if I could find any goodies uh, I didn't really, but anyway, I've managed to get on this pod point now, so I think I'm going to have a, a sneaky 10%. Let's get plugged in. Well, I've just confirmed the charge on the app, but the screen here is saying this output, and it is on CCS 50 kilowatt, is out of order. So I'd better have a look in my car and see if it's charging. Okay, in the car that says connected, not charging. Oh, it might be having another go. I just heard a click. Okay, I don't use these pod point rapids very often and there was a little bit of fiddling about required but it does now appear to be charging. I don't really need a charge, I'm at 70% but I'll take it up to 80. Let's take a look inside the car. Well, it is charging but it's only 58 amps at 383 volts. Now on the 50 kilowatt Ospreys, I'm normally used to seeing about 120 amps negative. So this is running at half speed. This is only really giving me 25 kilowatts. So not all chargers in South Ryslip are out of order. Um, a lot of them were in that particular retail park where Asda and Aldi were. But this one's working and if you're prepared to uh, wait for a little while you can get on it. And I am now on it and let's see how well it's doing. Okay, it's up to 71%, so I'll take it to 80% and then I'll head back home. Well, that's the state of EV charging in South Ryslip. Cheerio.